Hello, Namaste, good morning guys. Hope you are doing great. This is Dr. S. Krishna Kumar and I am here to present the salient features of my brainchild, my book which is titled Crisp Physiology. At the beginning, at the outset, I clearly want to thank all of you guys for the enormous encouragement you have given for the past two editions. It actually is the motivating factor for me to come up with this even well improved third edition of Chris Pulsen and trust me. Next thing. Now, in all the recent exams in the past two or three years, you are clearly seeing lot of image based or picture based MCQ. To make you guys answer those type of image based MCQs, every chapter is now having lot of images previously asked in the entrance exams. You can see a special section on image based questions where you can see those images. All these images are again concept based only. Once you are clear in those concepts, remember these images are a cakewalk for you. To aid you in your preparation, these images are given as a separate boxes in every chapter. Now, we the biology students, we are always allergic to mathematics during our higher secondary studies. But that mathematics again comes to us now in entrance exams, particularly in physiology in the basis of calculation based MCQs. Particularly this calculation based MCQs are very high yield presently. That is why there is a separate section on the possible calculation based MCQs that can come in physiology. You can obviously go to this calculation based MCQs near your entrance exams during your final revision. They are definitely a sure shot question these days. To aid your preparation, there is calculation based MCQs discussed in this book. Now, the title of this book I have given is CRIS, which stands for Complete Review of Integrated Systems Physiology. The word integration is most important. Present day entrance exams it is not only about physiology, what is the application part of physiology most important, that's why integration. Not only in my book, in my classes also you see it is always about integrated physiology. What is the meaning of that sir? The relationship of physiology in clinical medicine. You see lot of information where you can apply the physiology knowledge which is actually required for your clinical practice. This can be usually seen in the form of clinical conditions that can alter those physiology, the relevance of physiology in pharmacological drugs, the pathophysiology, as far as possible I integrated physiology with all the major subjects, all the major 19 subjects you prepare for your entrance exams. That is the most important thing, the special feature your seniors who have cleared previously have highlighted this aspect of the integration. This book is known for that. At least please buy this book for the integration part. Mm. Right. First thing about the book is that it contains the most recently asked entrance exam questions uh, which is in front of me as you can clearly see the most recent questions are highlighted in box. Why we did that? Because it is always the recent the most topic which is repeatedly stressed in all the entrance exams. To make it easy for you even for final moment revision, these recent questions are highlighted in the beginning of every chapter's question and explanation. The next important aspect of present day entrance exams is understanding the significance of acid based physiology and acid based abnormalities. Such an important area guys, to sensitize you towards that topic, there is a separate section I devote entirely for acid based physiology. You will get a clear cut understanding regarding the physiology behind this acid based balance. Not only that, I have given you sample calculations to work out to find out certain acid based abnormalities. which is again a highlight of this book. During our undergraduate days and also during PG preparation, one of the nightmare for all the medical students is understanding and diagnosing conditions with the help of electrocardiography, ECG. 
there is a separate section devoted in this book which totally talks about the physiological significance of this electrocardiography. Not only that, to sensitize you guys, whenever you read clinical medicine, there are lots of applied electrocardiograms images also given in this book. So physiology knowledge along with the application part which can aid you in diagnosis in long term, in short term, you can also solve lot of PGME questions concerned with electrocardiography. So guys, I listed you the salient features of my book Quest Physiology. But the most important the beneficiaries of this book is going to be you. Rather than saying me, you can always ask your seniors whoever used this book. You will get an even more better idea regarding this book. As I always given in the preface of this book, my motto here is always for PG aspirants. This is the first book you should read during your PG preparation. And this should always be the last book you have to revise during your PG entrance exam preparation. With that note, I am signing off. Thank you so much guys. Thanks for watching this video. Good luck.